Ah, so welcome back. Yeah. So how long were you gone? Oh boy, I don't know. I mean, what what year is it for you? 2012? No, I mean like outside time. I don't know. I haven't been back. I oh. don't really... Oh, well, um, Happy New Year. You were gone a week? I think so. I feel th- there was a lot of alcohol consumption and... God, I was just sitting here texting and poking around in here. Oh man, t- wait, time is weird. And speaking of weird, what what are you holding there? Oh uh, yeah, looks like you cut a naval mine in half and then like glued either end to an a Eastern Orthodox bishop's staff. Yeah, um, I don't know. I found this. I found this stuff while I was a. Uh, poking around in here you just found it lying around sam creek's house that's no it was in the it was in the boxes in oh the okay that's still his house i think yeah so i don't know i mean i don't know what's doing here but i kind of dig the uh, you know chunky eastern block aesthetic you know kind of like uh you know season means production workers of the world unite um other leftist catchphrases i don't really understand where do the blue LEDs fit into the communist revolution, comrade? They're gauges. What do they gauge? I have no idea. That one just has, like, the dial from your stove on it. Yeah, I... Do you... I'm not sure what, cha- what twisting it does. Do you set it to broil? Can you... Does it have an auto-clean function? <laughs> I hope so. Cleaning guns is a pain. But anyway... Yeah, I mean, I just found these things, in these crates. I, I don't know what he is doing with these weapons. Well, I mean, he's he's Sam Krieg. That's true, but like, it's weird. You know, he's he, he's using them for research. Sure. You can hey, you can get away with anything if you tell people it's research for a book. That's true. Yeah. All right. So, oh yeah, I found. Um, I also found the last piece of that thing that we were pick- we were gathering that the Phoenicians were after. Was that in one of those boxes too? Yes. Oh. No, actually it was in Sam Green's trash can. Of course. Of course it was. Did I mention I fucking hate purple? Now we know the Phoenicians weren't at the amusement park just to enjoy a little family time. I can only imagine the repercussions from us beating them to the punch and gathering these relic pieces. Can't say I'm worried about it, just surprised by their interest in Beaumont as well. Seems he sparked quite an interest. Other, either way, job well done. Keep up the good work and keep an eye out for any more Phoenicians storming out of the cracks. Wow, oh, it's like some little effig, some sort of occult effigy. I think it boosts my power. I am, I am not going to be surprised by that. I'm making a conscious decision. I have stopped being surprised by basically anything I do. Yeah. I am just... I don't even understand myself anymore. I am kind of surprised. So, like, those pants have decent pockets? It's, you just shoved it in there, didn't you? You just... Uh, no, it's... Uh, huh. Where'd I put it? Oh, no, it's, see, it's in, my, it's in my jacket pocket. Oh, there it is. Okay, yeah. All right, well, let's do this thing. Sand Creek has an itchy trigger finger. Why is he using some lever action rifle when he's got like weird Soviet future tech in the his basement? I mean, doesn't he still write with a typewriter? Yeah, good point. Yeah. And I'm sure he just drinks, you know, regular bourbon instead of future you know, gastrodynamic booze cream. Sounds make weird noises, right? Yeah. I mean, I thought that was just a thing that houses do. Around here they do. Oh, yeah. Yep. I should stop shooting these things as well. Yeah, let Sam Cree get some shots in. If he can pick them off that cleanly, does he even need the flare? Is he just trying to make you feel like you were a part of the team? I think so. Damn, he is a good shot. He's got good timing, too. I swear he just waits until one of them is about to bite you. I'm sure that's on purpose. Yeah. 
Well, that didn't change much. Mm, no. So, what else should we try to get rid of these damn things? Well, wait a second. They, they like... Oh, wait. I, I know. Throw them off a cliff? I was just going to think that. Like, they like to eat these corpses, don't they? Yeah. Well, maybe if you, like, pick up the corpses and you put them on the cliff... The zombies will run towards them and they just like all fall off like a wily e. coyote. That is a very dumb plan. Do you have anything better? No. Okay then. I'm sort of just gathering up corpses. I mean, I think at this point we've exhausted all the smart plans, you know? Like barricading yourself in isolated areas, shooting anything that moves. Uh, all, all that's failed. It's time to go dumb. Sure, why not? Dumb plan it is. I think that's an Orochi corporate motto. That would explain a lot. Yep. Alright, now to take these things, throw the zombies off a cliff, because that makes sense. That'll get rid of them. Well, even if it doesn't, it'll be really funny. Fair enough. I mean, it's, it's the end of the world. You may as well have fun. <sighs> oh, yeah. I got a new power. Oh, yeah. Wow. You are tall. What do you mean? I'm only five foot seven. Well, I'm... Yeah, but with your power and stuff. Right. Please okay. tell me your power doesn't grow you to five foot seven. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> 25% taller. Well, it's a good thing that Imperial measurements are so easy to multiply. <laughs> I have to actually calculate that in inches. Let's just multiply everything by 12. That makes sense. Well, Imperial measurements were based on Charlemagne's body dimensions. Oh, uh, don't... Don't get us started on Charlemagne. <laughs> what? What about Charlemagne? Nothing. Oh, right, he's Templar. He's a goddamn Templar, wasn't he? Uh, yeah, I mean, anyone, anyone with like that big of a crown on his head and uh, um, did he have a mustache? I'm gonna have to look him up. You know, his name basically means Big Chuck. <laughs> <laughs> I could believe it. Wait a minute, I just wondered something. Where's the light coming from? Uh, uh, that's a good question. Weren't, weren't we in there? Yeah. This will take further study. I'm gonna have to look closer once I get in there yeah. again. As for now, yes. look at these convenient wooden pikes. Yeah, that's really not... I'm so glad that someone... Oh my... That... Oh... I... I did not mean to do oh, it that way. How how do you do that by accident? Well, I heard some sp I heard yeah. some splats. I should have been watching. Damn it, I should have been watching. Yeah. So, okay, so throw the zombies off the cliff. Let's see what happened to them. All right. Wait, that zombie Making his way downtown. <laughs> I think he left something here. Did he send an SOS to the world? Said their survivors hold up. Oh my god, where? Some houses down over there. I'm gonna have to check that out. Okay. Oh shit. Oh wow, this still works. By the way, I did math, and can, yeah? figuring out the figuring out the the bullshit alchemy of the of you know U.S. customary measurements. When you get big, you are exactly just short of seven feet. Wow, that's yep. actually kind of disappointing. I know you miss it. You miss it by less than an inch. How much do I weigh? I'm not going to answer that. 
good. So let's see. Let's see what happened to the zombies. Although if you increase by 25%, your weight would increase. But... Nope, sorry, not answering. <laughs> Square key blog, don't forget. Yeah, yeah, I'm trying, oh. to, I'm trying to figure that out. Um, did you see that? I did. That, that was a big fucker. So, dropping zombies off a cliff might not have been the best idea. No. No, it would not. Uh, everything I do yeah. makes giant zombies. Why? It's... That... Maybe... Maybe... Maybe you're a natural necromancer. <sighs> I am not a necromancer. Yeah. Actually, you'd actually be twice as heavy... If you're, like, 25% taller. Huh. Well, again, you know, just under twice as heavy. So, ballpark 300 pounds? Yes, let's go with that. So, yep, yeah, giant zombies down here. I mean, were they here before, or... I'm sure there's some who fell off without my help. Okay, so, see, it's, it's not you. This this would have happened regardless. Yeah. Oh, it's another one of these things, isn't it? So... I like the backflip. That was very necessary. Okay, yep, yep, definitely fall, definitely one of those wells that yeah. gives them, that makes the big zombies. It looks like somebody was bottling, or barreling it, though. I'm not surprised. Why would somebody barrel it? I'm a little dismayed, but not entirely surprised. And boulder push. Hey, I just got an idea. What? Crushing the zombies with a boulder? No. Oh man, I like Sam Craig, I really do. His books always made me giggle like a schoolgirl. He's not even 100% wrong 100% of the time. Then again, even a broken watch is right twice a day. Unless you go digital, then we're down to one. You focus on a black pool here was, of course, the correct focus. This dark matter obviously has an effect on everything it touches, living and dead. And we're getting more and more reports... Like yours. I don't need to tell you that we'd prefer to be in front of the curve on this. That's what... That's the what. I'll leave the how to you. Thanks. Real... Real motivational there. So... You remember seeing the barrels at the top of the cliff? Yeah. Now that you mention it. So I think I'm going to go do something about that. All right. Wow, that, that dude's having a rough night. Yeah. Let's see. If I get past the telephone pole and... Oh, he's going to... I'm seeing if he has a clear shot. I think he can make this. I'm just seeing if he does, mate. Let me wave. Yep. See? I am impressed. Yeah. I'm going back there. I should probably get some of these supplies from. Hate to see the old bastard starve. Like I'm sure he's got enough liquor to last him for years. I mean, have you read his memoirs? Yeah, have you heard what he supposedly eats every day for breakfast? No, I don't think. This is like. I'm imagining just, like, raw eggs simmered in the fat drained from cow brains. Not too far off. Which which wouldn't be raw anymore, would they? No, no, they wouldn't. 
So, I'm not... Uh, you know, these barrels... So they just left the barrels up here? Whoever did this? I mean, I guess. I mean... Look, if, if they're if they're bottling up, like, liquid evil, they're practically a Captain Planet villain already. True. I want to destroy these. Maybe it's... Maybe it's Hexus from... Uh, fuck, Fern Gully. Oh! Right, yeah, the filth makes them. Yeah, oh. Probably not a good idea to just spill the barrels all over the ground then. Yeah, just keep it off the zombies. I found the Sam Krieg breakfast special. Yeah? Some, some guy's got a blog about it. It says really? here... One tall glass of one tall glass of orange juice, heavy on the pulp. I've already forgotten what he sounds like, so I'm just gonna do what I imagine someone like Sam Creek would sound like. One tall glass of orange juice, heavy on the pulp. Two pieces of brown toast spread thick with margarine. Whoa, okay. Uh sh shit. Okay. Oh. I drew a I drew one of the one of the black Zombie things. Oh, oh Check my! Go ahead. Oh my God! Look, you see how the, how like they they kept waving around even after it was still dead. Yeah, I've seen those things waving out of the ground for crying oh. out loud. Oh. I mean, you've seen that too, right? Yeah, you were there. I was, but I think I was just block that from my memories. Okay, fuck it. I'm just running. See, yeah. One la one tall glass of orange juice, heavy on the pulp. Two pieces of brown toast, spread thick with margarine and soy sauce. One boiled egg, and one glass of bourbon. It's the soy sauce that gets to me. Yeah, that's a uh, soy sauce. I thought it'd be more of a Tabasco, man. Yeah, I know, right? I imagine he just like does straight shots of Tabasco. <laughs> imagine he just like puts it in a syringe and injects it into his eye. That is a very odd lighting effect. Look oh, at it's that. Just, Look it's at just it's a shadow it's a shadow of the lighthouse. I've never seen a shadow that distinct before. Uh crepus crepuscular rays. Yeah. Yeah, but I mean I've never been in them, you know? I've always just seen them, you know, from a distance. Well, if there's one thing we know about those people with the barrels is that they can't be too bright. Placing buckets of poison on the side of the road is a tactic about as sophisticated as, hey, your shoelaces are untied. Captain Planet villain. Use this black substance to do a little spring cleaning on the other hand doesn't necessarily qualify as a terrible idea. We'll have to learn more about it and have the magicians do some field tests, but we should certainly look into it. No. Good thing you destroyed the prototypes, primitive as they were. We don't want anyone... Us to it if it pans out. Is your first thought weaponizing this shit? Her first thought when she takes a shit is to weaponize it. Uh, thank you for that. You're welcome. Okay, so... Huh. I just thought of something. What? Uh, I'll just put it on my later list. Oh, come on. Don't leave me in suspense. Okay, so there's the beam. Uh, look at... Oh, there's a light. I mean, that... It's not as... But, like, there's no lens. How is it moving? Or is it coming from above us? Something's weird about this. S just one thing? Just the one? The one thing about reclusive author Sam Krieg living in a lighthouse that doesn't seem to work in the middle of zombie town? Okay, so there's a lot of things that are weird yeah. about this. Yeah. Oh, look, here's a microwave. Oh, good. I'm, I'm surprised. I thought he killed all his food and cooked it over a, over a roaring fire. Transmit. Initiate te technical support signal. Receive, sweetling. Do not chill. Scream in panic. Your sysadmin is going manic. The bottle caps do not lie. We exist outside the eye. Q base. Q penthouse protocol. Q sex. Drugs et al. Witness our embrace. Don't be fl Don't be huffy because we hack. 
The buzzing appreciates all you do. The world is dying. It's all true. Oh god, I hope it doesn't start rhyming now like a freaking 80s cartoon character. Friend, find, look behind. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so. Th results. They're sending you text messages now. Apparently. Oh, wow. I'm just, uh. Yeah. I'm just accepting these things now. Yeah, that's fair enough. Critical empowerment results. You can't like mm -hmm. question everything. Well, you can question it, but it's Critical like empowerment at some results. point, diminishing returns kicks in. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that must that must be where yeah. he sleeps. Hmm. I have a similar setup. Kingsmith was founded by the Illuminati. This whole community. The entire island was built by Kabbalists. They claim they picked this place because it was isolated, easy to protect. Bullshit. There's power here, begging to be released. And the Illuminati, they tried their best. He knows a lot. They uh, they could tame he knows it. a little more than he, he should. That's why the entire island is riddled with esoteric markings and archaic symbols, with tunnels and secret rooms. They dug deep, and what they found scared them. I mean, then again, is this really more than like Padre Pedo stash new? Up eventually, moved on to bigger and better things. Oh no, he's got a lot more specific information. Those who remained, well, who would they leave behind? Not their best and brightest, I can guarantee you that. Those people, they kept feeding on the power until it permeated everything. The town, the forest, the school. That's what brought me here. To succumb myself in evil. To understand it. Learn about it. Write about it. But it seemed to have faded. Like the paint on the picket fences. This place seemed no more cruel than any other small town on this blighted continent, filled with pettiness and jealousy and murderous thoughts, but human. Boy, was I wrong. I'd say I got more than I bargained for, but you might think I got exactly what I deserved, and you'd probably be right. <laughs> 